It's funny the idea of choosing a topic. I don't really choose a topic because uh, uh, the world chooses the topic. My life chooses a topic. So um, w when I compose something or when I uh, uh, improvise something, it's it's from me. So. I don't have to, uh, you know, take time and say I don't have any ideas. Where can I get ideas? I have too many. There are too many topics. We have uh, topics today of war and peace. So I don't have to choose that. I, I don't want to choose that, right? So um, these are uh, topics that that are that exist. We have so many crises in in the world. We have crises between people, personal uh, crises in the schools and and. Um, uh, we generally, in the whole world, is, is completely disoriented. So what do I have to choose? I can't choose. The, the crisis, the problems are there. And music is not something uh, that is to um, divert from these problems. It's to show possibilities of solutions. It's a real thing. It's not uh, something to be consumed like a, a chewing gum. So. Uh, I don't. I choose the chewing gum, but I don't choose my themes. There's so many people that that inspired me. But um, I once did another interview, and they're not musicians. It doesn't have to be musicians. Why should it be a musician to inspire a musician? Musicians are well, not always the best people, to be very honest. Uh, artists have a, a reputation of being so free and, and nice and but I have to say that, uh, I'm sorry to say that the majority of, of my colleagues and also artistic colleagues uh, are very uh, overly connected to themselves, very, uh, very narcissistic. And so I get uh, inspiration from people completely outside of uh, music. I get inspiration from people I meet, like here, for instance. Um, but um, inspiration is actually, I, I don't even believe in the word. It's actually just tranquility. If you have something inside, you just have to have peace and it will come out. You need tranquility. So um, the rest comes, you know, I, I don't get inspired if I look at the tree. I have to see the tree. I have to have time for the tree. That's the only way you can get inspired. But people, musicians, uh, of course, through the centuries, Prokofiev or Bartok, uh, are some heroes of mine, but also some very old uh, heroes from the uh, 15th century, like Johannes Ockeghem. Uh, in jazz, not very many, but I have a few heroes, like Charlie Mingus. And as pianists are concerned, there's Arthur Schnabel and, uh, and many, many others. Shura Cherkasky is a Ukrainian uh, 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 pianist who I also admire. But the word inspiration is... is uh, it just basically means to find yourself. And if you don't have anything inside, you can't compose anyway. So that's where it comes from. I guess my, my style of work, it is good. I like the regularity. I like order. I like regularity. And really, uh, you know, especially when you're filing, you know, filing off the music, when you're, you're doing in the end process of, of, of some piece or some composition, you, you do have to have some kind of regularity, or at least I do. Uh, but sometimes ideas come in my sleep when I'm dreaming, or sometimes they come uh, suddenly when I put something together that was not together before that. But I, I think I'm relatively orderly uh, with that. I'm not a, you know, like romantic, I have an idea, you know, this, I don't have that. <laughs> I don't I do that, but what I need is, uh, um, to be honest, cl cl uh, cleanliness, order. Uh, if I don't have the house in order, I can't work, so. I'm not one of these, you know, artists sitting in some attic where everything's completely crazy and uh, I have to finish my, no, just uh, no, uh, please no, uh, no thank you. Uh, it's, uh, I need to have, and I will get on my knees and I'll clean that, I, I'll do everything myself before I start going to work. So, and the ritual is uh, Fisherman's Friends. <laughs> I have to have a mint in my mouth shortly before the concert. That's how simple I am. Almost everybody will say that the work they're doing now is the most important. So 
that's kind of uh, that's subjective. You know, I don't it might not be the best what I'm doing now, but I, I feel it is because I'm doing it now. So, at the moment, I'm writing a, a series of songs of art songs for baritone and piano, and I've written sixteen songs to uh, uh, to lyrics by very important English poets like Byron and Wordsworth and and uh, John Dryden, John Donne, and many others. And I, I think I can do it pretty well, too. Uh, I, I'm not always secure about what I uh, do, but here I feel pretty secure. And uh, also just recorded a CD with some of these songs. So the most important work I'm doing, I feel at this moment, is are these uh, these songs, but I also enjoy very much my own organ music, my organ improvisations, which are a little bit, uh, they're not necessarily very accessible. Sometimes they are, but they're not, I wouldn't say it's the most accessible part of my music, Just, but it does happen to be the part that I might like the most of, of what I uh, do artistically. I don't need the career, but I would I would write the music. I would even if somebody uh, put me in a, a insane asylum, which might be a good idea, uh, and they give me a piano, <laughs> I would go on and write my music. You know, I would. Uh, but the career part of it is actually the fly in the soup, isn't it? Uh, the career part means you have to deal with monetary situation, you have to deal with capitalism, you have to deal with consumerism. And uh, that is just not an artist's world at all, is it? And today, we're absolutely forced. So if you talk about freedom, people like to say we live in such a free society. For artists, this is not at all a free society because uh, we cannot just do what we think is right. We're, we're very much bound to sales. And uh, so career... You know, it's positive on the one hand because you ha you're, you're doing something publicly. On the other hand, the career is exactly the problem. Well, the, the, the answer to the question is uh, I don't have to have the career. I, I'm happy to have it, uh, but um, I don't have to have it. But I would continue to work as a musician somehow. <laughs>